everyone, it's Brianna and I am doing my hair. I'm straightening it. I deep conditioned it for um, like probably 12 hours or so. It was overnight. Um, and yeah, I'm going to blow dry it and straighten it. And I wanted to show the process to you guys. So then if I get further heat damage or whatever, then I can blame myself. Okay, so I'm gonna start with the back of my hair and just put in a couple of products. Um, I'm not sure if this leave-in is... Um, like a heat protectant so I went to Walgreens and got a heat protector that I used to use before just to um, you know double check and make sure I'm only putting two pumps of this leave-in conditioner in just because I don't want my hair to be weighed down but I still want it to be moisturized um, so working that into my hair and then going to go in with the Tresemme heat tamer um, I haven't used it yet, so I'm just waiting for the product to come out. There we go. Okay, so go ahead and get that worked all the way through my strands and all the areas. And I'm going to try to power through this as quickly as possible. I have a comb attachment, but it's so garbage at this point that I'm just going to use my brush to, um, deep condition or to um, blow dry my hair in small sections. up half of it split my hair down the middle so that it will be easy to figure out which way to make each part of my hair go I already have a part for my hair to go this way and I'm going to tie up half of this side so that it's just easier to work with and I'm just kind of gonna jump right in here um, I like to feel my hair and see kind of how it feels um, like at the ends or whatever just to make sure that it you know doesn't need any more conditioning or you know product or anything but I'm going to go in with a clip as well and section off each piece as I go essentially just to make it easier and I'm gonna comb through the section And I haven't done my hair or flat ironed it in forever.
doing the last section of my hair and I wanted to come and talk to you guys about the process. It took about an hour for me to um, flat iron my hair, I would say. Um, again, I'm not a professional, so a lot of the things that I do with my hair don't necessarily look the same as the results that a hairstylist would. But I still wanted to kind of have layers and curls. I think the next time I straighten my hair I will use more heat um, to get a sleeker look but I did like the volume and stuff that I had with um, this style also the next time that I do this I'll focus more on my ends so they won't look as frizzy but I just really wanted to make sure that I didn't give myself heat damage so I wanted to be safer um, with the heat that I was using and as you guys can see I am finished this is kind of the results of what my finished product looks like um, I'm going to use a hair clip to kind of hold the hair down and make sure that you know it's not as poofy and kind of will lay down a little bit when I need it to and I'm kind of just touching it not really doing anything just showing you guys kind of what it looks like in the back um, it definitely looks a little drier than I would like it to. I want it to have a little bit more shine. So, um, usually after this point I will add a serum, but I don't do it on camera. Um, I just wanted you guys to know that that's kind of what I would be doing with my hair. Um, actually I think that is what I'm doing right now. Okay. Take that back. I am adding a serum to my hair to kind of make sure that my hair is moisturized and shiny and all that good stuff. And yeah. Hopefully you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, please like and subscribe to not miss out on any more of my content. And I will see you guys in my next video. Thank you so much again for watching and I will talk to you guys soon. Bye.